Back in 2008, we were the new kids. As fun as being the new kids was, I think it's time to pass the torch. It's over. We're over it. I'm married. I'm married. I was on time to this. <laughs> um, and the truth is, we are not new anymore, and we're not kids. So now it's time to meet the new, new kids. They're not even that cool. But I think they can handle it. We'll see. <laughs> Morgan Bryan, St. Simons Island, Georgia. Julie Johnston, Mesa, Arizona. Crystal Dunn, Rockwell Center, New York. My favorite music is country and everything but rap. Country and hip hop. A little bit of rap, a lot of hip hop, and a lot of country music now. Yes. Crystal says she likes country, which I've never known. Everybody loves country music. I've been in North Carolina too long. <laughs> my favorite foods are anything my mom cooks. Sweet potatoes and avocados. Chinese food. Yeah, I love Chinese food. I love bacon cheeseburgers too, though. My first soccer team ever was the Red Hot Chili Peppers. We were maroon and fantastic. I'm not really sure what the name was, but we wore teal. <laughs> the Golden Tigers, and we were gold. Yes. <laughs> it looks like a monkey. <laughs> Julie Johnston, age six, Blue Dolphins, awkward. <laughs> Winning the U20 Women's World Cup was unforgettable. It was the best time of my life. Every single one of us was crying and full of emotion just from the past two years that we pretty much gave up our lives for this team and for it to all come together, the U20 World Championship was pretty an unforgettable experience. My first camp in the national team camp, I was um, I was nervous, I was excited, I was honored to be around players that I've looked up to since I was so young. My emotions were pretty crazy. I think when I got the call I was really surprised. I almost wanted to hang up. Uh, I've been dreaming about it ever since I was a kid. I think I could say it was a dream come true. You know, when you're representing your country, you're not only just representing yourself, but you're representing, you know, where you come from, your friends, your family. And for me, I mean, my town is small, so for me to put Rockwell Center on the map in any way I can is is a great accomplishment. Off the field, Julie Johnson is quite chill, just like myself. She's just forever laughing. You can tell it's her from a mile away. <laughs> On the field, Julie Johnson is a beast. Is a monster. She wins tackles. She's aggressive in the air, on the ground. She's a great center back. You can always expect that your team's going to win with her on it. Crystal Dunn, off the field, is either dancing, singing, or sleeping. I don't think I've ever seen Crystal outside of her bed, except if we go somewhere to eat. On the field, Crystal Dunn is athletic. She is a great player and very dynamic. It's hard to read and hard to play against her. Off the field, Morgan Bryan is a Georgia Strain Dane. So chill, so relaxed. She just has these limbs that are just like, you know, she's just going with the flow of things. On the field, Morgan Bryan is extremely smart. She reads the game really, really well. She's composed and um, has a great final pass. She's smooth with it, like smooth like butter. Wait, wait, okay, one, two, three. USA! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. USA? I went down. Yeah, I, so and down, I went up. Um, USA. Okay. USA! We really respect all the players, especially our veterans. But there's really one that we have a soft spot for. Hey, yo. Oh, you guys. <laughs> <laughs>